Hello everyone, welcome to Scadia.com. I'm Maham Afridi and our topic for today is laboratory diagnosis of viruses. So in today's topic, we'll be covering the basic introduction to diagnostic methods. Uh, we'll see the common approaches to the diagnosis of viruses and then we'll go through classical de uh, detection techniques as well as near detection techniques. Um, for diagnosis of viruses. Um, we'll start by discussing the basic uh, uh, techniques like the identification in cell culture. We'll see how we can identify the viruses in cell culture. And we'll also see the limitations of uh, certain diagnostic techni um, techniques. Then there are techniques like uh, complement fixation, hemagglutination, fluorescent antibody assay, um, radioimmunoassay, ELISA, etc. Uh, in these, almost all of these, uh, we'll be um, seeing the antibody antigen interaction, and through that, we'll be um, uh, trying to see how we can um, diagnose different viruses. And uh, we'll also um, um, focus more on diagnosis of uh, certain important viruses like the hepatitis virus and um, the human immunodeficiency virus. Uh, then we'll move on to electron, uh, immunoelectron microscopy and other microscopic uh, identifications um, in which we'll see the basic uh, um, uh, microscope, the electron microscope, etc. And we'll see how we can directly detect uh, presence of viruses in cells um, by just visualizing um, the cytopathic effect that uh, the virus might have caused in um, a cell. Then we'll see certain serologic methods um, and we'll uh, see the IgM antibody test and why is it used and what are the viruses for which we can uh, use the IgM antibody test. And then we'll finally det um, uh, discuss the detection of uh, viral antigens in nucleic acids. Um, so there are certain tests that are developed um, uh, that are very specific to the type of viral antigen which might be present inside um, a cell. And so we can directly detect that virus and uh, that viral antigen or a particular viral nucleic acid can be detected inside the cell. Um, this, uh, in this, we focus specifically on the um, the uh, double-stranded structure of a viral nucleic acid or the viral RNA, and so tests have been developed that can identify these and um, uh, differentiate them from the cellular nucleic acid um, in a, in order to diagnose um, a type of viral infection. So we'll be discussing all of that in today's lecture. I hope you're excited to learn more about lab diagnosis of viruses. Thank you for watching Scadia.com.